Bonjour, ni hao. Welcome back to the Game Boys channel. I'm Johnny. And I'm Tim. And today we're here with a haul video. video. And it's an artsy kind of theme. We have some gym shores that have been kind of sitting in our room waiting to be filmed. And then we have a Thomas Kincaid that is new from this year that I had to get because it's one of our favorite movies and it's beautiful. But I do have a gym shore that I just bought this coming week that John doesn't know about. Because <gasps> I want to surprise him because it is one of our grails. And I, it was just such a good deal I couldn't pass it. So we'll save that for last. Oh my goodness, I had no idea. Mm -hmm. So I kind of was on a kick since, as many of you guys know, we no longer do a certain subscription box that basically was our Jim Shore supplier. <laughs> so like, we decided we should just get ourselves some every once in a while because we do miss having... Adding to our collection. Yeah, through that box, but that'll be a whole nother video. But yeah, like I decided I wanted to kind of finish the White Woodlands we are only, after this, I think we have two more we need still. Oh, we do? Yeah. Oh, yeet. Do we want them? Um. Ah! Uh, maybe. No, I'm okay without that I one. I don't know. Then. We'll see. But, so first I want to show the White Woodland of Belle. Alright, so this is Belle. And this is one of our favorite scenes when she is with the little sheep. Lambs? I think they're sheep. But she looks so pretty here. She has her little basket, which the detail on that is great. They really worked the wicker. You have, you don't have real words on her book, but it's fine. And then you have the Jim Shore patterns on her dress. The sheep all have that Jim Shore pattern on it. There's her shoes, and then you could see, I love when they do stonework like this. And then there's nothing really too special on the side of these. Sometimes they put castles and stuff, but there's her hair. And this one's called Bookish Beauty. <laughs> but this is so pretty, and it looks really nice next to the other ones. Yeah, so that one's just so pretty. And I don't know if you guys could see, but Tati missed being in our videos. And she didn't like being in the middle of us. So let's see how she likes being on my left. She's always on my left. And now you're getting on my last nerve. So <laughs> switch, Tati. See, baby? Tati, look up. Say hi to everybody. Say hi. <laughs> All right, and then the next one I will let you show. Oh, this is a, this is a white woodland? Yeah, they all are. But why is this one so much smaller than the others? I don't know, because their scene wasn't as exciting. Ah. <laughs> Here is the Mulan white woodland, and this white woodland is so cute because it features a rare appearance of Little Brother and Mushu. That's, so Tim and I just looked at I don't think Cricky's on here. But I love this bench. This is a very, I would sit on that bench. And this is called Hon Honorable Heroine. So these cherry blossoms here are so beautiful. And this is what I was saying, like sometimes they put a castle. That's Mulan's castle there. And then the stonework. Oh yeah, yeah, so we are missing two. Mm. Pocahontas is the other one I'm missing. <gasps> Alright, and then the last white woodland we recently got was the Cinderella one. This one's pretty. It's funny because there's a version of this that's completely colored, but it's the same exact everything. So I like the white woodland better. So there, her face looks beautiful. You have her pearls. And then you have all of the little mice there. You have Susie, Gus. Jack and then the pumpkins look really cool just with that white detail and then here you have the little crowns and the 
slippers. And I really like here, you could, they painted it pink a little bit on the ribbon to kind of like show that that's the scene when she was in her pink dress. And then the bows going on there. They didn't really do anything on the ground besides like the vines. But super cute. This one's called Darling Dreamer. So the only two we're missing now from the White Woodlands are Pocahontas and Snow White, which we're showing a Snow White one next, but you're probably wondering why are you guys showing Snow White? I'm actually starting to warm up to her, but the real reason we got this is we wanted every one from this series. And it's and a good she, one. She was cheap on Amazon. And the, I like the size of these. Like, these are beautiful figures, but sometimes I you need, like, thing in diff things in different sizes so that you can have, like, variety. There she is. Look at Miss White and her beautiful dress with her castle in the center and her yellowy dress that kind of reminds me of Belle. She's dancing, and this is called... Castles in the Cloud, not to be confused with the song from Les Mis. <laughs> yeah, so like, you know we love castles, and then this is kind of like the castle series. So, yeah, we have five of them now. We just need Anna and Rapunzel. Why is there one for Anna? Because there's already an Elsa one. What? Why do you need an Anna one when there's an Elsa one? Don't they share the same? two different people? <laughs> Don't they have the same castle? No. Oh. Hers is her, like, snow one. Oh, her ice palace. And then, and then there's Anna's... the Arendelle castle. Yeah. Oh, I forgot about the Arendelle castle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then we do have... I bought this small Marie Jim Shore because I had... You know, if you've seen our recent hauls, I always go nuts at Target and the $5, like, shelving things. So I needed something to fit there next to our Figaro one. So I bought this cute little Marie one, and she's actually much smaller than Figaro, but it's fine because she's a little chai, like a little kitten. So she looks just so cute with her little bow. Wish Tati would let us do that to her. And then there's like the Jim Shore patterns. But the cutest thing is she's on this little like pillow because she's a little fancy princess. And then her tail there. I love the little tassels. This one's called Marie. <laughs> All right, so before we show our Thomas Kincaid, I'm going to reveal the gym shore that I bought on eBay. It's one that I had a safe search for, and this person had it for a really good price. So I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna send an offer for $20 lower than they had it, and they accept Yay! it. Yay! See, you never know until you try. So, Have you opened this yet? Yeah. Oh, okay. It comes with the box, which like is very hard on eBay, because you know, people don't keep these in the box. So it's like, you really have to have storage. I am so excited about this. Don't look at it. <laughs> this one's so good. So pretty. So pretty. Is it from an animated movie? Oh. Oh gosh. Oh, this was a grail for us? Yeah. Was it? That, I didn't know that. The cheapest this has ever been is $400. I didn't know that we were looking for this. I wanted it so bad. Cause, uh -huh. Yeah, they made this years ago. He's been impossible to find for a reasonable price. That's a really good figure, though. Oh, hey, hey. All of the um, men that they make are super rare. The Hercules one is impossible to find. The um, Kristoff one super pricey. The Prince Charming one's very expensive. Oh, that's really cool, Tim. Isn't that amazing? That's really cool. The tattoos are really cool. 
That's exciting. Oh, I love it. Good find, Tim. Isn't that crazy? I can't believe I own this one. You're welcome. If anyone's a big Jim Shore collector, you know how valuable and rare this one is. But there is Maui from Moana. And what's cool, the coolest part is like, you look at him and you see all the different tattoos. So there's him getting like applause. There's the hook. You have Tafiti there. You have him just being crazy. You have everybody applauding. You have them on the boat. And then him on top winning. But the awesome part is this like is so detailed, his little grass skirt. Hey, Hey's there. He's kind of like super fragile, so don't mess with him a lot. <laughs> he has some big feet. And I love that the hooks are along the side of this. Oh my gosh, I am so happy to have this one. Literally thought I would never get this one, which is why um, I pre-ordered the Moana one with the waves because Maui was in it because I never thought I was going to get this one. And he's called Darren Demigod. Oh, so amazing. So is he going to go on? We don't have a he's Moana He's going to go in our living room. Ah. He is special. Yeah, we have the Moana one up there. Oh, that's right. See, Tati already got bored. <laughs> This is why we don't make seats for you, Tati. <laughs> she saw, oh no, she saw a box. She's excited about a box. She's trying to figure out if she can scan inside of it. Oh my god. <laughs> so now it's like I need the one of Philip and Aurora dancing. Mm. And then like my grails are gonna be almost complete. Yay! All right, and then speaking of Moana, so the last item we have is a Thomas Kincaid. We love their canvases. We have like maybe nine of these. Of yeah. Different princess movies. When they when we found out they were coming out with this, I was so excited because like I love all the water movies and just like the scenes are so pretty. Um also comment below on how you feel about the new Moana movie live action <laughs> and the Mo Moana like meat tree yeah or although whatever. shape of water or whatever that's called uh, I don't see any like hidden characters Char you actually have been on a huge Moana thing because you just bought that other item that's in our living room too mm -hmm. <laughs> I know I, I am Moana it's a great movie it is a great movie all right so I will show you they do have like the bigger size but that's way too expensive and like most of the ones we have are the size so look at um Tafiti there looking gorgeous and then you have the awesome sunset you have their sail and then Moana Hey Hey and Maui are there you have little turtles underneath and then you even have um who's the crab Tamatola yeah, and then like the birds there. This just is so pretty. And then it continues on the side, and a lot of times they put like a hidden character on from a different movie in this. I don't see any yet. And then they continue that side. Let's see, no, I don't see anyone on this side either. But just that water looks so pretty. Makes me want to go back to Hawaii. And then we have that Certificate of Authenticity. Yay! So this will be put out in our living room for summer. We have a spring one right now. It's so pretty. I love it so much. Mm -hmm. There's so many good details in it. Mm -hmm. Thomas Kincaid is like one of our absolute favorite artists. And you never see like fish friends. Wait, is the only other person I haven't seen yet is the grandmother there? Or like a stingray? Not that I see. I don't see grandma. It could be on a bigger version. Um, like this might be it, but it's like cut off. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, it's like, it's so weird having to <laughs> 
by Gym Chores herself because we were getting used to having them in that subscription box like every month. Or a lot, of, a lot, most subscription box started putting all of them. Down. All of them, yeah. yeah. But this, that certain subscription box, literally, you got one in every single box. <laughs> And we were like, whatever. It was nice, but I love all this art. I feel I feel like Wow. We're so classy now. <laughs> yeah, we have them all above on shelves. We actually did we film it or we never did the gym short. I don't think we did, right? No. Actually, yeah, we did. We filmed our villain gym shores and our um, Halloween ones, I believe. We'll link that above and below. But yeah, comment below if you ever want a full tour of our gym chores. We do have quite a bit, but it won't be as difficult to film as our Funkos will. Oh. So you'll have to let us know what your favorite one we opened today is. And if there's any that you think we need that are coming out, because there's quite a bit coming out in September. Are there really? Mm -hmm. More gym. Yeah. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Yes, and if you're not a subscriber and enjoy Disney game, pop culture, and lifestyle related content, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you're notified of our future videos. And if you are a subscriber, thank you so much for joining us. We had an awesome time hanging out with you and we can't wait to see you in our next video. Take care and be well.